in Tagalog, Caldereta. Hi, my name is Kit DeCastro and welcome to Cook Kitchen. On this channel, we help people prepare delicious home-cooked meals. And for today's Cook Kitchen, we are gonna cook my family's version of caldereta, or in Tagalog, caldereta. <laughs> we already prepped everything here. There's only one thing left to do, it's time to cook. Let's go, let's go, Cook Kitchen. It's cooking time. It's time to add our onions, adding our onions. And we're going to add our garlic. Do it in medium heat. Mm, I like the smell. Now we're going to add our julienne cut bell peppers. Still doing this in medium heat. Nutritious. It's lots of vitamins. Now after two minutes of putting the bell peppers, we can now add our beef shanks. It's gonna be good. Two or three minutes. And then we can add our liver spread. Our liver spread, adding our liver spread. Versions of caldereta, they don't add liver spread. Some people don't like the taste of liver. Leak place, the liver spread is evenly placed. Evenly placed. <laughs> add our tomatoes. Now we're gonna add our tomato paste. Two tablespoons. Tomato paste. You don't have tomato paste, you can use tomato sauce. We're gonna add our beef broth. For about five minutes, and then we can add our pan fried potatoes and carrots. Now we're adding our pan fried potatoes and carrots. And now we're gonna add our cheese. No cheese. Add for this version, I want to have a little kick in our caldereta, so a little spice, spice up your life. <laughs> Two tablespoons of fish sauce. This is optional. We're gonna let this simmer for about 8 to 10 minutes, and then after that, we are done with our caldereta. The origin of caldereta is Spain. The word caldereta is actually from the Spanish word caldera, meaning cauldron. In the Philippines, there are different versions of caldereta. Different regions have different versions of this dish. Other provinces use goat meat. Other versions add coconut milk. Caldereta is one of my favorite dishes. To be honest, when I make this dish, I can eat this for days. Lunch, dinner, lunch, dinner, lunch, dinner, lunch, dinner. Let me ask you, what favorite dish do you cook that you can eat for days? Type it in the comment section below. Time to try our caldereta. Mmm, sarap! And with that, another episode of Kitchen is finished. Thank you for watching. And if you find this video helpful, hey, make sure to like, share, and subscribe to this channel. See you in our next video. Let's go, Kakitsin!